Yo, what's up guys? This is Smokescreen38 coming at you with some more toy haul and action figure action. And today we are doing a haul video with all the stuff I got throughout the week from last week. Pretty much the end of December here. So, what is up guys? My no puppy. We gotta get some more people in here. Yeah, we gotta get some more people in here. No puppy, puppy. I right, get some peeps in here. <clears throat> Make sure everybody hears me. All right. <laughs> the puppy. Hey, the boy. The puppy. <laughs> yep, puppy. All right. What's going on, Chris? Fix the title. I have to do that on my computer, I think. Oh, shit. Oh, okay. I, yeah, I'll fix it after. Okay, it does say action figure. Okay. Just want to make sure. <laughs> oh, shit. Get some peeps in here. Licked and shaved, and you already sobbed. <laughs> oh, yeah. Surprise, Liquid didn't stop by yet. He's usually the first one. All right, now it's a little slow off here. I'm trying to get some people in here before I start doing some uh, haul stuff. Definitely. My little girl, what? My puppy. My puppy. My little puppy. My puppy. My puppy, puppy. I know. Let me get some more people in here. 
Hey Chris, so yeah, I just as a mean uh, Prime John One went to go see the Star Wars Last Jedi. Really good movie. Really good. I was like, eh, there's a couple stuff that irritated me a little bit, but overall it was a good movie. <laughs> I don't know if the comments are slow or yeah it was a little bit better than Force Awakens but it was pretty good though I liked the, I, I did like Force Awakens yeah I do yeah I do too So. <laughs> All right, Chris. <clears throat> Puppy. Love you too. Love you too. What? Um, um. <laughs> what? Oh, easy, calm down. <laughs> I'm puppy. What's up? I got another person just joined. What's up, everybody? How do you make a YouTube channel? <laughs> oh, on PlayStation, you mean? Um, it's very easy. Just take uh, your existing YouTube channel if you have one, and just just uh, put your email address in. And... Let's see what Liquid said. Meh, 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 meh. <laughs> meh. <laughs> Meh. <laughs> Good old liquid cool. The fuck? That's cool shit. That is cool as shit, Chris. Hell yeah. So is everybody here? Hi here, Diamond Love. There you are. I'm gonna be doing a. I'm just seeing if we can get some more people in here before I start doing this uh, toy and collectible haul. And I, I know I spelled figure wrong by accident, but oh well. <laughs> so it, uh, got my fan on because wood stove. It's hot. Alright, I'm gonna start it off. I think do some stuff that we got at got in the mail. I got this stuff in the mail. Oh, let's see here real quick. On Twitter. Oh, is he streaming on Twitter now? <laughs> I know puppy. Puppy's always loving me. I know. I love you too. I love you too, puppy. <laughs> Diamond Love, you like puppies? Here's my little puppy. Jimmy Little All About Puppy. 
<laughs> she has a little Autobot logo on her uh, on her charm. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, lay, lay down. Alright, sit back there. Alright, we're gonna start off with some items here. Oh, sorry, pretty girl. <laughs> sorry. First item, have it hanging up behind here. Remember, I got the metallic Red Ranger? I actually went and found it on YouTube for Teacup. Oh, <laughs> hey, you knock shit over, lazy. <laughs> um, picked this up. Good old Evil Bay. Freaking, se I think it was seventy-five dollars for this motherfucker. It's like now this completes my Power Ranger. Said prepare for a Power Rangers marathon on my Trans Aaron Thirty Eight channel. And it's like to build a figure. Finally get to build a figure. And <laughs> you see where she's going. <laughs> she wants to go up the covers. But, anywho, Red Ranger finally in my possession. So, right there is a metallic. This is the metallic Red Ranger that you find at Walgreens. So, hang him up there. White Ranger Tiger Power! <laughs> Alright. Next up was another item in the mailbox. Picked this up. Transformers Robots in the Skies. This is my childhood. You get Night Cruise, Mirage GT, and Scavenger. You get three in one box. It's pretty badass. Brand new in box. Picked them up. Doing all the mail stuff. Oh, lazy enough to shit over. Anyway, anywho, I know if I showed it on my stream. I finally finished my Shockwave. This little piece here, got it from Evil Bay. This little piece here. Well, not that piece. I mean, the little lens piece on Evil Bay. It still works. Pick that, uh, pick that piece up, and uh, masters for Spinster, which is a little Target Masters, which I picked up at Morgan'sville. That one there, but uh, the Target Masters. Flip them back to robot modes. Can't really see them that too well, but. Pick those up, got that, got that complete, and then on my double dealer, grab him, got this blue piece here, it goes on his chest, finally got him to, got that to complete that, now double dealer, Power Master double dealer is complete. Next up is got my next cosplay costume right here. I tried it on today. The jacket is too is snug on me, but everything else fits me great. I picked up Attack on Titan Aaron Yeager costume. You get everything in here. The jacket and all the other goodies. And then this big boy came in the mail. I have another one coming. This is Attack on Titan. Part of their mobility gear. It's a sword. So this is wood. So it's not really metal because it's a cosplay costume. 
what I'm going to do is build a build a uh, mobility gear and have it sot on the side. The square piece that goes on the side is this is going to be this is going to be holstered in. So I'm going to extend this with more string or maybe a hose, like a rubber hose kind of thing, to give it a nice show accurate. I said this some bitch is huge. Alright. Sit that there. Alright, another mail. Mail call. All the way from Hong Kong. Do you believe? Check 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 one two. No, Taiwan. All the way from Taiwan is Mike Gunna Brave Brave Revival Legends Might Gunner. The Brave Express Might Gain Might Gunner. Very cool. Pick them out of the package here. Which I already had them taken out. Comes with a nice chromed out sword, very nice, for a great to make the game for perfecto mode. Get him out of his bubble. Hell yeah. To train. Mike Gunner. Very nice chromed out details. Very nice. He transforms into a little handgun you can hold. And he transforms into to this cannon mode. Which is pretty cool. So. This is the newer release. This is better show accurate than the original toy release it got. <laughs> we'll transform him into a sniper mode. So we'll just leave that there. Pull his legs out. Pull that back up. Pull that little piece down. And there's his handgun mode, which is weird. Got a little little trigger right here. But you go in here, there's a black piece. Turn this off so you can hear my fan anymore. And then you hit this. This will this here will roll like a gun. Perfect the cannon, fire! But his other mode is pretty much for a shoulder cannon for great might gain. What you want to do here is just pull his arms down. Pull this sucker all the way up, right back. Take these around. Now you can pretty much see if you want to take this off, make it a little bit better. Set that off to the side. So you can cock this piece back. Because when you pull cock this back, this black piece back, watch this cylinder move. Which is pretty cool. So I'm gonna have to dig my brave figures out to do a combined mode for this this figure. It gets plugged in on his shoulder in robot mode, which is pretty cool. 
We'll transform it to his robot mode. Kind of looks ridiculous, but there he is. And that piece that you take off, you just fold this down, pull this lever up, becomes a shield. So, all right, that was Mike Gunner. You pull this down in the back too if you want. Set Mike Gunner off to the side. Money well spent for that figure. Alright, we'll shove this over here. With all the other junk I got. Alright. Next up is a haul from Greg Monroe. Picked up. Titans Return double pack from Greg Moore, which I already got from my uh, one of the buddies I'm with on Facebook sent me one and John one, so I have an extra one here, so maybe I'll do a uh, giveaway with it. So there's a twin double pack, Walgreens exclusive. Prime Shrapnel, Shrapnel they're calling them, he's an Insecticon, got him, then uh, Dinobot Slash, a new Dinobot recruit, and it is a female, female Dinobot, Velociraptor. Pilot Prime's Wind Charger. Very nice. Pilot Prime's Beachcomber. And then Prime Masters, Vector Prime with Metal Hawk, Pretender Armor. And then Micronus Prime. You can see, oh shit. You see on the back where there's spark, looks like the different sparks on the back. You can do that to Liege Maximo. See, each of their sparks are different. You see a little window. Little window there. Liege Maximo with uh, Skull Grind. And you got Vector Prime with Metal Hawk. Micronus with Cloud Burst. These here are going to Prime John 1, which I actually got a set, an extra set. So, just to show you, here's Liege Maxima, Pretender Armor. Fold this down, little Prime Masters inside. If you can get his ass out of there. Liege Maxima is just the hardest one to get out of his Pretender shell. Alright, and he comes out, he's a little robot himself, 
just like a Titan Master. Instead of a head, it's a spark on the back. So you can fold him up. And you can still plug these guys on uh, Titan's return figures. There's a spark. Fold this back up. Bring this out. Flip the handle out. Now it's a claw weapon. And then there's little tabs in here. Slot Liege Maximum in. That's a powered up weapon. What's up, 13 viewers? So, that's Liege Maximum with Skull Grind. And then uh, you got Metal Hawk with Vector Prime armor, Pretender Shell. Pull that down, you get the same kind of concept. These guys here are pretty much a target master. Then you fold him up. He's the same little robot. And just fold him up, just like a headmaster does from the Titans Return line. There's his logo. And you power this weapon up. Slide everything in. Clip it into place. That's a powered up weapon. Cloudburst and Micronus. Pull this down. Dig his ass out if you can. Come out. His face painted a little bit blue. Fold him up. Turn into a target master. Fold this up. Pull that up. You got another powered up weapon. So anywho, there was the Prime Masters right there. Did pick me up a game drive with a PS4, two terabyte, good old Seagate, eighty damn dollars, eighty dollars. Picked that up today. So, all right, I think that's it for the mail haul stuff. Picked this up at Hobby Lobby. It's a little keychain belt clip. I want to get John one too, but it was, uh, the one that they were missing was missing this, this little uh, little belt buckle piece. So, which is pretty cool. Then you put this on your belt. Nice Autobot logo. So your keys are secure. Picked that up. I got Rick and Morty poster and another Star, uh, Star Wars poster. This white is not going to be here for much longer. Posters are going up. Much more needed space. So, yeah. Alright, so I got these posters. Alright. While we're at Hobby Lobby, picked up snap tight model kit of the Millennium Falcon. $30 for that fucking kit. I couldn't find it for a while. Also picked up. Very happy to find it. The first order heavy so ATM6 Walker from the new The Last Jedi movie. Got me a hot glue gun, glue stick for my cosplay costume, Zacto blade knife, some blades. I got poster board too, but I'm not going to worry about showing you that. But I'm going to be making my uh, cosplay costume with the tubes that goes with that sword for my uh, Attack on Titan. So, anywho, set that junk off to the side. Walgreens actually had Jet Fire. Eight steps to change. Very cool.
I was waiting for this guy to come out. Looks like someone cut the box like right there or something. <laughs> but anywho, got that. Got the Star Wars snap tights. Then we went to FYE. Picked up Rick and Morty blind gift box for 25 bucks. It was on sale. It was like 30 something dollars before. $39.99. Pick this bad boy up. Let's see what's in it, shall we? If we can open the damn thing. Oh my. Here we go. First item. It looks like the poster. Yeah, that's hilarious. Rick and Morty coffee mug. It's hilarious. Rick and Morty single glass. Rick and Morty, of course, you know. The hell? Mr. Me Seek Salt and Pepper Shake. <laughs> <laughs> oh, shit. Oh, man, that's freaking hilarious. Let me open it. Let's see what it'll look like. I know, right? Oh, they are glass. They are glass, fellas. Holy shit. <laughs> You got salt and pepper shakers. <laughs> oh shit, that's funny. Mr. Poopy Buffalo. <laughs> All right, and then you get a couple other extra goodies. All right, let's see. You get a Rick and Morty keychain. With a portal gun keychain and yeah. So that's what was in that box. I figure there will be at least something nice in there like something like a like a pop vinyl or something. Which I'm not worried about collecting pop vinyls. Jeez. Don't get me started on them. Which I'm not dissing pop vinyls. Might end up giving this box set to Web Junior 1977. You might like it. Alright. That was the box set. And FYE actually had this, surprisingly, Rick's Portal Gun. Oh, well, thank you. I'm a little puppy. Come here. Hi, lady. Hi, puppy. Come here. <laughs> Say hello, lazy. Hello, puppy. <laughs> Should 
She's my little Autobot puppy. You can see a little Autobot charm right there. <laughs> but Rick's portal gun. This actually has sounds. And actually, it's pretty cool. I turn my light off. Look at this, fellas. You can do that with the portal. Which is freaking hilarious. Can't really. Here we go. Let's try this. Nope. Shows better on my white wall here. Which is pretty funny. It's like, so I'll probably be doing a cosplay costume with that because that, that'll get matched this because I've got this at Spirit of Halloween. So that sucker will look nice on my wall right here. Oh yeah. All right, next item up. It's another Rick and Morty thing. I can't believe they had shirts. Can't believe it. Strawberry Smiggles t-shirt. <laughs> I had to get it. Strawberry Smiggles Crunchy Marshmallows. Also, with that purchase, you get a Free pin with Strawberry Smiggles guy. Little pin. And I didn't know they had Squanchy bars. Squanching creamsicle bar. <laughs> They're going all out with this Rick and Morty shit, which is awesome. <laughs> so I got two of them. I'll probably enjoy one here later on. All right. And, so the hell with it. A lot of people will be like, ah, would you do the high here liquid? Reptar cereal t shirt, Rugrats. <laughs> Pick that up. And they finally got them. Reptar candy bars. Mm. Yeah, I got ten of those some bitches. Good old Fye came through. So I got ten of these some bitches. Ah, uh, don't tell me. Prime John 1 probably grabbed one on the way out. But, little bastard. But anyway. Oh yeah, Red Walrus. What's up, man? Nice to see you, man. I was like, finally got him. Reptar cereal bars turns your tongue green. Rugrats. <laughs> yeah. So, yeah. Definitely. Taking a shitload of that. I don't know. Now, are you talking about the Reptar bars or are you talking about the Squanch and Cream Sickle bars? Squanchy. <laughs> so, definitely. 
Got my cosplay costume for Attack on Titan. Got my cosplay costume. Got that. Got my sword for Attack on Titan. Oh yeah. Reptart bar. We're going to open that sucker up and find out for now. There's the candy bar. <laughs> what? It's gooey in the middle? What the hell? Look at that. It's green. <sighs> Hope I don't die. Mmm. Mmm, that's pretty damn good. It's like green in the middle. It says turn your tongue green. But they were on buy one get one free. They're two ninety nine a bar. <laughs> the reptar bars. Oh, it's worth it. Oh, green tongue. <laughs> but anywho, well, refresh there, Red Walrus. What what all you missed, buddy? Want me to refresh? <sighs> Picked up some Transformers Jetfire from Walgreens. Picked this set up. Picked this uh, complete box set up. Brand new Transformers Robots in the Skies, the original Robots in the Skies. Where's my phone? There it is. Star Wars Snap Type Build Kit, Model Kit, Millennium Falcon. Pick that up. And a new Star Wars AT ATM6 Walker from The Last Jedi movie. And if you guys watched that movie yet, it's a really good movie. I highly recommend getting it, fellas. Pick that up. Rick and Morty uh, blind gift box. I'm going to open it back up. But you get you get salt and pepper shakers of Mr. Me Seeks. Uh, you get a glass and a coffee cup and a keychain. Yeah, that walker looks pretty badass. I liked it from in the movie. I seen it. It's pretty cool. There's Rick and Morty, Mr. Uh, Strawberry Smiggles. Strawberry Smiggle shirt. <laughs> All right, Chris. I'm going to end this on an hour. Reptar cereal shirt. <laughs> Transformers Titans Return. Wind Charger. Pick him up. Female Dinobot Slash. From the Power of the Primes line. Insecticon Shrapnel. Scrapnel they're calling them. I guess the copyrighted names. Lost the rights to them. 
Power of the Primes. Power of the Primes Beachcomber. Mike Gunner, all the way from Hong, uh, Taiwan. Good friend over there. Hooked me up. And then uh, Transformers Prime Masters. Got me a surge of drink, you know. Rick and Morty portal gun, pick that up. I'm not done yet. <laughs> oh, thank you, Crystal. Now, like I said, I picked up my Attack on Titan costume. Is Aaron Yeager. Everything fixed except for that damn jacket. Might have to find a jacket and get iron on logos. They don't fit plus size men, you know? Where's the love, fellas? Where's the love? But. Attack on Titan Sword. It's made of wood. I have another one coming in the mail. And I'll be making my uh, mobility gear for this because whenever I get it, I'm going to have it slide like a holster. It's going to be like a holster, but it's going to be like the mobility gear in a show. I'm going to have a big, big, huge box thing on the side here. Where this will be the holster for it. It's not going to be show accurate, but I'm going to be making a cosplay costume. The box, uh, the whole mobility gear. They have, they have mobility gear out there. Thank you, Red Walrus. Um, but I'm not paying $400 for mobility gear. <laughs> so... So, I think that's just about it. Except for I got, got my part to my shockwave. My G1 shockwave, the lens. Throw on that. Yeah, makes noise. Still. So. Then I got those candy bars. But, yeah, that's a lot of stuff I got today. Definitely. Oh, and I picked up a Seagate game drive for the PS4. It's actually hooked up to it right now. Downloading some games. That watch I had to reinstall because I ran out of space. So, got me an external hard drive, so I don't have to worry about that. I'm going to turn that fan back on. Ugh, getting hot. Let's go wood stove, fellas. Go wood stove. Go. But, yeah. This is a cool little haul. Um, anybody else want to see anything in here in the game room? If, you're, if you guys are new, don't forget to hit that subscribe button. And don't forget to go over to my Trans Air 38 channel. Um, it'll be down in the description down below also. Um, I review all this kind of stuff. Uh, from Transformers, Iron Man. I'll be doing these uh, Rick and Morty play sets soon too. I got some play sets to review. I'll probably end up doing a live stream for them. Especially the big the, the big box set with Rick and Morty in the garage with the spaceship. I'll probably do a live stream. I might do live streams for these. I'm not sure. Yeah, I do believe Game Dungeon's the only one that's on Twitter. I guess I, I, I think he got tired of uh, you uh, got tired of getting strikes for, uh, from YouTube. So I could be your new uh, Game Dungeon Productions. <laughs> But now, uh, I got some, I got retro games, so I pick one right off here. 
Beavis and Butthead, you know, for Super Nintendo. Um, I do, I also do some retro games, so don't forget to uh, subscribe, fellas. I do Super NES, NES Classic, uh, Sega Genesis, uh, Nintendo 64, and uh, I do a couple live streams on this channel too with uh, good old buddies Prime John 1, Liquid Cool 440. Hello from Scotland, what's up? Drink some Surge. Probably over that way it was called Urge, you know, with that the S, Urge. Would love to try that if they still make Urge. Oh, Red Wallers. <laughs> Red Wallers meet Red Ranger. <laughs> picked this sucker up. 70, I think 70 or $75 I picked this guy up. Finally got all my original Rangers complete. Now I can build the Zord and do review uh, reviews of these. What is Surge? <laughs> it's a citrus flavored soda, my friend. They still make it. Oh. Yeah, I was just doing the toy haul here. TDH get murked. I did, uh, I collect all kinds of this stuff. I got a whole bunch more. Even down to the nitty gritty, uh, slut busters. You know, the new, the new slut busters. You know, get it? <laughs> but, uh, yeah, if any of you guys new to my channel, just give me a shout, uh, give me, give me a heads up if you want to see something in my room, you know, be free to ask. But, uh, <laughs> I was lurking. <laughs> are you related, are you related to Chris Stuff? <laughs> Chris Tough one. <laughs> Grab this one over here real quick. Some hairs on my shelf. There's Rick and Morty plate. 293 freaking pieces for this. Spaceship and garage comes with Rick and Morty. So these ain't open yet, so I'll probably do a live stream of them. Alien vs. Predator. Ah uh, no, I I'm, I uh, I try to try to limit like what kind of stuff I collect, but uh, I do I do have a Attack on Titan. You can probably see Aaron Yeager right there, and then I have another Aaron Yeager over here. A buddy at work got me another Aaron Yeager by accident. Over here is my I have Mikasa and Aaron Yeager. So, I have a couple other things. I got Xbox over here. I got the Sega Genesis box. A couple of my Masterpiece Transformers. All kinds of different stuff. Um, mostly over here on this wall over here is all my Star Wars stuff. <sighs> That's one uh, place that they're uh, red. My room's kind of a mess right now. But... Here's another play set. I showed you this one. This is uh, Smith's Family Garage with Mr. Meeseeks and Jerry. <sighs> Evil Rick and Morty. these up today too. Oh, they're freaking good. <laughs> My puppy. And then there's these uh, little little mini play sets too, red wars. Red. You get a uh, scary Terry.
Yes, Toys R Us. Toys R Us got to Red Walrus. Walmart and Target actually got this shit. Check, uh, at my Targets, where they had this stuff, the Adult Swim stuff, they had it back, uh, back in the electronics aisle. Back over, uh, DVDs and stuff. They even had Ants in My Eyes Johnson. <laughs> Play set. And then you got the Discreet Assassin. Walmart would be your best bet. They actually have Attack on Titan stuff. Uh, they, they have McFarlane figures. It's it's crazy Walmart's doing this stuff. It's like, I don't even know. I was like, this back here, this is B, uh, BT7274. I picked him up at a Walmart. BT7274. I actually did an unboxing and review of him on my channel here. So, check that out. He's like, that's pretty cool from uh, from a Titanfall 2. And uh, you got your bootios up there. You got bootios, Transformers launch box I picked up, Reptar cereal box. Close up of the launch box for you. This is definitely retro, 80s. Got the Dinobots on the side. Got Metroplex right there in base mode. Trypticon on the other side. You can see the rust and where the thermos was. Yeah, I got me a, the strawberry smiggles also. This is an FYE. It's an FYE exclusive. Oh, really? Disco. <laughs> Might end up putting this lunchbox somewhere. You just can't really see my uh, smiggles. But there's an Iron Man figure right there from Walmart. I got Transformers here. I got Star Wars and stuff over here. My room's a little bit mess messed right now, but let me give you a pan here real quick over to the side. There's my retro TV and stuff. This is my bedroom too, so. So. And also I have Transformers on my shelf over here too. There's a shelf with my Transformers. There's some storage over here. It's like, you see something here for you fellas. Without knocking shit over. Ugh. There's some Transformers on my shelves. It's a little bit of a mess. Like I said, I, I gotta redo some stuff. There's my Star Wars wall. Other cool stuff. There's my reviewing station right here. As I, you see, I have everything like situated right here. This is my reviewing station for my figures. You can see Skylink's here with the Power of the Primes. He's all combined up. All right. There's a little tour for you guys. I plan on to try to get my room bigger. So. Oh shit. There we go. There we go. Perfect. Thank you, fellas. Yeah, I also I was like my my YouTube channel. Other YouTube channel is uh, Transaaron38. Don't forget to check that out. But uh, coming in an hour here on my stream. If before we go, is anybody else here new that wants to see something? Uh, let me know. Yeah, I also collect the Star Wars. Uh, if you guys remember that line, Star Wars Transformers, Emperor Palpatine and his Imperial shuttle. Uh, Web Junior has a couple of these open, but this one here is sealed in box still.
here is Transformers Star Wars Transformers General Grievous with wheel bike yeah that's old definitely <laughs> Now these two are open, but I kept their boxes and put them back in. Here's Clone Commander Cody with Turbo Tank. And here's Lord Veda in a TIE Advanced TIE Fighter. Good old Prime John One gave me this one. I opened them up, was exciting. It was like, then I was transformed like the instructions said and broke a piece off. So I fit, found the parts that replaced it and replaced it and uh, put it back in the box and I ain't touching it no more. Yo, what's up, man? <laughs> I was like, showing off some stuff, man. No, I don't collect any G.I. Joes. Voltron? I do have Voltron, the new Voltron. But, like I said, I collect Attack on Titan figures too. Mikasa Eckerman and Aaron Yeager. Collect those two. I was like, I collect Gears, Gears of War figures because uh, I'm a Gears of War fan too. Um, just trying to think. I have my Voltron here. Hold on a second. Give me one second. Nah. What's up, Liquid? Without trying to knock everything over. Also collect the Masterpiece Transformers also. Red Alert and G2 Sideswipe. Here is the posable Voltron I got. Now we will destroy you. The posable Voltron. I also got the other Voltron, but he is in a box put away. And uh, I actually took a while to find the damn pieces. John, my buddy Prime John 1 just Hate, uh, just, just play, playing GTA, oh, hell yeah. But yeah, definitely. A lot of new faces, fellas, thanks for stopping by. I was like, a lot of people don't come in here. I also uh, got a sealed box. You guys probably remember some uh, Transformer Cybertron. Any Halo? Ah, I'm trying to think if I do have any Halo stuff. Uh, the only Halo figure I got is like the clear Master Chief. I when the Halo, uh, what was it? Halo Reach came out. I collected a shit album, but it, then I ended up. Like, uh, getting hard up for money and selling stuff because I didn't have a new job at the moment. But, uh, I don't have no more Halo figures at all. But Transformers. Class Act. Who's that? Maze. I was like, Cybertron Defense. Hot Shot. Freaking amazing. And it's... KB Toys, uh, 1499's up there. And I didn't pay 1499 for this. That's a piece of, uh, history right there. I ain't gonna take that tag off. You can tell how old this figure is since it was in KB Toys. Give me one second there, get murked. Give me one second. Ugh.
like I said, I got the Red Ranger. Okay, got the Red Ranger. That's one. Green Ranger. This one's open. Green Ranger. Uh, whatever's on my card over there by my head is uh, the 90s versions. I don't have any of the original. And then this one here is an unopened one signed. You can see, see right here. Signed by Rita Repulsa herself, Carla Perez. So I got two Green Rangers. Pick, and there's a White Ranger. I got him. Blue Ranger. Uh, shit. Knock the shit over. The Black Ranger. Yellow and pink. So yeah, definitely. Hang them back up. I'm trying to pull them back up. That's what I'm talking about, right? Walmart. Walmart really sucks balls. Trying Walmart and Target, because everywhere I go, the only Ranger I had to pay overpriced for was this one right here. I paid seventy-five dollars for this son of a bitch because it was nowhere to be found. Scalping motherfuckers. <laughs> no offense, trying to make an extra buck, but damn. <laughs> just go. There, there's nothing wrong to collect or whatever. As I get picked on daily about it, I don't give a shit. Oh, there we go. Come back up on the wall. Well, yeah. New Power Rangers movie. Freaking loved it. Freaking loved it. I actually got. Every one of their figures from uh, hold on a second. It's the closest one nearby. Fire Rangers. I only collected the five Rangers themselves, but I didn't see Rita Repulsor herself yet, so I don't know what the hell. Here's something that's out of the ordinary in my, my collection it's Pacific Rim, Gypsy Danger, Reactor Blast. Can't wait for the new movie. Someone did ask about Voltron earlier. No, I didn't get into collecting any Marvels there, DJ. There's Shiro from Voltron, the new series that's on Netflix. I got Shiro, Lance, and uh, Keith. I got, uh, it's like, there's a, there's a Shiro he was only able to grab. Yeah. It's like, there's a lot of people that gets, gets uh, scalping with their prices too there. Merc. Yeah. Get merc.
Oh, hell yeah, that's what I'm talking about. Yeah, the ones that he here, like, these ones here, I like collecting these ones on card. Where's Boba Fett? These are just uh, reissues, I think, aren't they? I'm not sure. But I have I have a whole wall of them. I only collect what what like I'm not going to collect like Boba Fett that battle damage and Boba Fett has this or something. But it's like they do that they do that with every figure. If you guys ever recognize that, I said I just want one figure. You know, <laughs> you got this one. Cool thing is, I, I picked this up a long time back. Deluxe Boba Fett with jetpack. It's a Kenner. San Diego. Hold on a second. Let's see here, real quick. The only exclusive I got lately, um, trying to uh, remember here for a second, it's a Hascon exclusive. It's a Hascon exclusive. It's Transformers. Titans Return Hascon exclusive. RC and Ultra Magnus. RC and Ultra Magnus Titan Master. I would say that's like close to a San Diego Comic Con I'll get. My one buddy got you know this is over a hundred dollars or more on eBay. My one buddy got it for me for forty-five bucks. He lives over in California. Yeah, I want. I did want to show you guys uh, Overlord here, the new Titans Return Overlord. He has these chest compartments in here in his chest. You grab these Prime Masters I showed you guys earlier. Grab these Prime Masters. The clear is yellow. Oh, <laughs> yeah. That's just showing. Uh, Pennsylvania. You grab these little sparks and you just set these in here in Overlord's chest, like a G1 Power Master esque vibe going on. Which is pretty cool. The blue one just really don't show up too well. Let me grab. There we go. Looks pretty badass. You can shut these if you want. They don't shut, they just close. Let's see. It's pretty cool. But yeah. Um, it's the Power of the Primes line that just came out. It's cool that they're uh, they're giving us uh, all kinds of new new characters that we didn't have yet of. <laughs> but yeah, this one here is definitely old too. Red Walrus. This is an older box set. I just got this the other week. 
All right, Mert, don't forget to hit that subscribe button. My other uh, YouTube channel is Trans, like Transformer, like Trans, AARON38. Don't forget to hit that subscribe button on that channel. Ah, oh, I did have one spawn figure. I left my web buddy Web Junior 1977 borrow it to show his one relative. Oh, uh, it was the it was the clown, the the, the fat clown. It was just his clown uh, form. Whew. Yeah, where I'm at, it's almost four o'clock in the morning. So I better head to bed myself. But uh, yeah, I was like, I did do a little toy haul here for you. Got the new AT AT uh, M6 Walker. <laughs> no, no right. Nah, I don't. I don't collect too many to spawn. I was like spawn I, if I find them. Yeah, I like to. Keep, I like to keep stuff on card. Uh, the, the the why why I said it's my other channel is Trans Aaron Thirty Eight. I love I love reviewing Transformers. That's why I put my name as Trans A A Ron Thirty Eight. So uh, Smoke Screen Thirty Eight here is my other channel that you guys are on. Um, don't forget to hit that like, share, and comment, and don't forget to hit that subscribe button. And uh, I do all kinds of live streams this year, occasionally. And uh, later, Disco. Thank you, Red. Thank you, man. Now the puppy's a little tired too. She's over there laying down. But uh, 33 viewers, thank you for watching. Very well appreciate you guys stopping by. As I like, was able to get some Reptar bars going on here. Got my Reptar cereal bar t-shirt. Uh, whole kinds of stuff. Uh, don't forget to check out Web Junior 1977, Prime John 1, Game Dungeon Productions, Peace, Game Dungeon Productions, Chris Stuff, Iowa Hawks, Dr. Jekyll, The Nerdy Effect, Ron Mexico, um, uh, Freddy's Ready. Don't forget to check out Freddy's Ready. Don't forget to check out Lethal. Uh, Lethal, he's a good... good uh, streamer too yep you too disco thank you for watching everyone but uh now said i'll be doing some more of this uh i, I don't go back to work till uh next wednesday so expect some more uh live streams but just to give you guys a heads up don't forget to hit that subscribe button for both of my channels web junior 1977 especially because i may or may not be going i may be going over to web junior 1977's tomorrow so don't forget to check that out. Um, depends on what's going on. Maybe I'll be headed over there and do a retro stream, live stream with him. Who knows? But until next time, fellas, thanks for watching. This is Smokescreen38, Trans Aaron38 talking again. Don't forget to rate and subscribe and comment on any videos I do. And keep a lookout for new videos headed your way. And this is Smokescreen38 and Trans Aaron38 talking again. I'm out of here. Until next time. Keep on surging it up. Get fucked up on the weekend. Till next time. Michael Serrano. Um, <laughs> but, uh. Age don't really matter. It's a two and a six, you know. They've been collecting since I was younger. Yeah, my little brother still makes fun of me till today, but. He looks at me and he says, damn, you got a lot of shit. <laughs> but, you know what I said, guys? This is Smokescreen38 talking again. I'm out of here. I'm going to hit the hay. Uh, check out my downloaded games here since I got this new 2TB uh, hard drive also. So, definitely going to be doing some more of this later on, fellas. But don't forget to check out Liquid Cool 440, Liquid Cool 360. Um, I almost forgot about you, Liquid. Didn't, didn't forget you. You thought I forgot you, didn't you? Don't forget to check out Liquid Cool. He is playing some GTA 5 live right now with Doomsday Heist DLC action. Don't forget to check that out. Um, I do believe uh, Prime John 1 may be playing with him. I may not. But until next time, fellas, this is Smokescreen38 talking to you. I'm out of here. Later. Peace. Boo!